Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. UFI security systems aren't no stranger to this channel. So maybe you already saw our review about the S4 Max security system in the past and I was really intrigued by that 4K bullet cam pan tilt zoom combination they had in there. And now you can get that cool combination combined with a solar panel. So a completely autonomous system called the UFI cam S4. This promises all the crisp images you are used from UFI security cameras, plus the intelligent tracking thanks to the completely mobile pan tilt zoom camera. And all of that completely autonomous thanks to its solar powered module. So does it live up to that promise or is it just a mixed bag? But we are here for that, so let's find that out. And as always, a great product journey starts with a box. And that's the box. Let's get rid of that super reflective foil. And here we have it. And we are immediately greeted by that beautiful <laughs> solar panel. Yeah, I can see here also the two options how to mount it. But let's see what else is in the box. We'll take a closer look in a second. What else is in there? Here you can see immediately the beautiful massive camera module. Yes, yes, I feel immediately brought back to the S4 Max NVR system where they have a similar camera. It's not exactly the same, but the principle, the base principle that you have that bullet camera and that PTA set module that can pan, tilt and zoom in. I think it's up to 360 degrees. Yes, you can just make a 360. And yeah, it's a really great module, compact, sturdy, <laughs> yes. But as I said before, let's take a closer look in a minute. Let's see what else is in the box. Here we see the mounting stuff, cables. Okay, that's all we've got here. Here are a little mounting sticker, so that's really cool. As always appreciated so you know where to drill your holes if you have to mount it in a wall and need those uh, screws that are delivered with it so you don't have to make it more difficult than it has to be that's really great and then this one comes this bracket comes onto the wall and then the camera just slides into it this is their usual mounting method with those UFI cameras and I'm really into it because it's really that easy. You just slide it then into it and it fits perfectly. Then you just secure it with those two screws that are also secured with a little uh, spring and yeah, so you can lose them. Then you have a printed manual, but to be honest, you don't really need that because the app does everything. So it guides you through the mounting and everything. So don't be afraid. Everything is really convenient and easy to handle here. But the really cool part for me is that the solar panel is not fixed on the camera itself. I mean, you can mount it like you see it on the box directly on the camera, but it's not the only option you have. So you can see here, yeah, there are those mounting points direct or the, where the screws go are there on the camera so you can mount the panel directly on the camera but if it's more convenient for you to put the panel somewhere else it's also possible and only limited by the length of the cable so if you have a place with better sunlight go definitely for that option and yeah as said you're only limited by the length of the cable the connection from the panel to the camera is here a quite weatherproof uh, port and if you ask yourself, but where's the battery? It's just right behind the camera module itself. So you just loosen the screw and then slide that open. And here is the battery. So that's also interesting because so you can get that battery out there. You can charge it or you even have to charge it for if you're using it for the first time for the setup. It is uh, recommended to charge it 100% and then you have easy no problem with the whole setting up of the camera. I would also recommend doing that indoor, even if you mount it outdoor. As I showed you, that bracket makes the uh, positioning very easy. So maybe mount that bracket outside and then do the whole setup process inside, connect it to your Wi-Fi. And so you can get sure that your maybe your Wi-Fi transmission is not the problem and stuff like that. So if it works indoor, then go outdoor and strap it to the wall or your fence like in my case and as 
promised the app guides you really through the whole process so you don't need that printed manual at all of course if you prefer that use it <laughs> but you have a step-by-step -step tutorial about the mounting about the setting up everything in the app really convenient stuff then you only have to mount it find the best spots to find the best direction for <laughs> where's the sun coming going and yeah then connect everything and you even get the message in the app if it detects that the solar panel is connected in a correct way so if it has a signal or signal if it gets power it tells you that it's successfully connected and then you have even some more tips about the perfect placement of your panel and so on and so on but the app is as we are used from eufy it's really convenient and perfect so there's nothing to be desired about the app so this is works really great but if you're not familiar with that whole module let's talk about a little bit what makes that special because that bullet and pt set in one module is a real beast so it has a fixed wide view thanks to this top camera uh in 4k and has thanks to the pc set module a 360 tracking capability so you can capture with the 4k camera clear facial details from up to nine meters and then just follow and zoom in with the pt set camera but you don't have to do that manually of course because ai tracking is doing that all for you so if the bullet cam detects the target the pt set camera locks onto the target and tracks it and zooms in and even sometimes catches you when you're making a break or so <laughs> Of course, this also works in the night and thanks to the great night vision capabilities of the S4, you can spot everyone that is in front of your house or trying to get in or stuff like that. And it's also worth mentioning that the motion detection really worked flawlessly in our testing scenario. So those passive infrared and radar combinations seem to work really great. So can't complain about anything here. And that's about it from my side about the UFICAM S4. And I really like it because I'm a big fan of those autonomous working cameras. So you don't even need any cables or anything at all. No home base, no uh, subscription to any cloud service or something like that. You just mount it anywhere where you have sunlight and that thing works. Just connect it to your app and you're all good. And if you want to find out more about that camera, just check out the description below. If you have any questions, just drop us a comment. And if you liked that video, give it a thumbs up, follow the channel, subscribe to the channel. No, 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 other way around and hit the bell button. And so long, I wish you a beautiful day and stay safe. <laughs>